electronic devices that might interrupt the performance. Well, welcome to the Alliance High School Orchestra. My name is Dan Adams. I'm from Worcester, and I'm going to offer some comments on your performance this evening. I'm really looking forward to it. You guys are on the stage right now, and he's the announcer is announcing what you're playing. Which we're going to be up to. All the pretty little horses. Going to offer some. Hopefully, some suggestions on how you can even get even better than you are. So, uh, please wish welcome you the, very best. the Alliance High School Orchestra. Here we go. It's a little concentration oops there at the beginning. Taste here. We need to put some space into those. Sing bit D da D a da da. A little space between the dotted notes and the tied notes, especially in those accompaniment parts now as well. Much too legato. It's easy to rush to that and after two. Da da da. Di da 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 da. Violas, I think you were the culprit on that octave C. Not quite on the money. I like the balance here. Been through the whole piece. Yeah, I just like to experiment with style and space. That joyous. I guess it joyously at the beginning. Let me look back. It's joyously. I think that can be accomplished by the style more than anything else. Little lift and lightness is needed. And that's going to help you rhythmically through that section too. Also in the cello part, first violin part. I'd like to hear you guys balanced on that. Really push back on those ands. And then bass. Almost like there was little rests in between all those notes. Be very appropriate. I like the sound of this group though. The uh, I think it's. Uh, the strength of the uh, cello and the bass sections, I think, giving a darkness to the group. Better start on this one. Some of us gave up on that first note a little early, violins.
didn't quite all release that together at 16, but I was enjoying the accuracy up to that point. you get up there you feel really good about landing and it's easy to rush on your way down. solo. I'd like to hear you sing that out a little bit more, Violin One. See if you can avoid some of those open E's. They're really jumping out at us. Definitely up there on that E string, those pitches just crying out for some pretty vibrato. That's something you gotta develop there, first violin. And that pitch as well. That uh, C, D, E in the first violins help you with intonation if you're vibrating those notes. As well as a nice tone quality, it actually aids you to play it a tune even better. Yeah, I'd like you to hear you work on a better transition from the harmonic in measure 60-61 the harmonic at 62. Same as at the beginning. Good control. All right. A lot of really nice things there. And again, balance is, is a real strength of this group, I would say. Start a little stronger there for better contrast. Again, we need some vibrato in the first section. Good job, cello. Add 
some pitch concerns, but I like the fact that I heard you adjusting quickly. Okay, accuracy in those last three bars before 35. Definitely use more second violin starting at 35, that melodic part. And even through here. be aggressive on those octaves first feel excuse me first and second violin that's a big moment there Projection from second violin, 65 through 67. More intensity on that melody, project it. Again, through here, more seconds, just like the same thing previously. Keep working on 91, 92. The, uh, I think the, ch the, the secret to that is just make sure you are keeping that metronome going in your head. Has to stay right in tempo, otherwise, we won't stay together on those last four eighth notes at 91. I think that's what happened to us there. So, and that, that means also the viola, cello, bass has to release right on beat one. You gotta, th you gotta really subdivide during that whole note as well. I'd like to hear you go after that one a little bit more with a little bit more intensity on the melodic lines when you've got them, on the moving notes when you've got them, more contrast to dynamics. Because you guys have shown that you do have quite a range of dynamics, I'd just like to hear hear that uh, come across in this this piece as well. Okay, and uh, keep working on that that pretty vibrato. That's going to really change the overall quality of this ensemble for the better. Keep it up, folks. Enjoyed hearing you. Good luck. <laughs> 